Hello, and welcome back to Rack and Ruin! It's been a very long time since I recorded those last two episodes, and... Well, I was not very happy with the sound of those two episodes. Hopefully it should be a little bit better in this one and the next one. I will probably further tweak it as we go on, because I just need to accustom myself to this microphone, and I think... I think I need to learn to sort of use my mouth a bit more properly and like word my words if that makes any sense like use my mouth better and not mumble as much I kind of just don't move my mouth very much and I think that might be why some sounds just sound worse for me I don't know I'll be working on it as we go on and again if you have any tips or anything like that or if you notice anything that I say wrong or poorly or anything then let me know so, what were we doing? Uh, it's been so fucking long, I cannot even remember, so... Was there anything I wanted to do before we went on to this area? Because I think I'm done with this, pretty much, right? So... God, I can't remember. Maybe we should just swing by the... The mayor? Because why not? Let's see, I need to reaccustom to everything, so how do I even do stuff? Take this! Oh. <laughs> okay, great. Fan oh, wow! Wait, are these guys just like super fucking squishy? Eh, kind of. Not super squishy, so maybe the damage isn't terrible. Right! I also wanted to test some stuff. I wanted to test this boomerang, because I, I think this boomerang seems kind of fucking useless. But hi! But if I try... some stuff... Like, I guess you can sort of kite around the boomerang like this, and it will hit stuff around you? Yeah, that's actually kind of cool. And now, I want to test, does it have the Zelda-like capabilities of fetching items for you? It does not. Souls? It does not. Yeah. Hmm. I don't really know about that, because... It doesn't do amazing damage, but maybe if you learn to use the... Like, dance around it properly, then it might be more useful. But... It doesn't do amazing damage, and it doesn't, like, stun enemies like in Zelda. And it doesn't... Do much, it doesn't fetch items, it doesn't, I mean, hit switches, but only some switches and only some elements, so... I don't know. I don't know if I really like it all that much, but... Maybe we'll find some more uses for it later on. Hello? Yeah, no, this is just the same stuff as he said before. I still don't know how to get to the... The corruption place in this one. Oh well. Also, I do think we could corrupt this area now, and then do the the dark thing. There were like three switches, like one here, and then one here, and then one here, and we had to hit all three at once. So I think we can do that, because we could definitely hit, yeah, definitely hit two at once. So if I throw the boomerang at one of them, and then hit the other two when the boomerang comes back, that should be fairly easy, right? So that's probably what you're supposed to do to do that. So... Yeah, I can't really think of anything else that I might want to... Actually, we might want to just pop by Baba Yaga and see if she's gotten anything new in stock or anything like that. I still don't know how this works. I have a message for you, Lord of Inevitable Failure. Greetings, Queen of Stank. Ooh, Stank Stew is the best! But I need a smaller pot. That orb-shaped skull of yours will work perfectly. Demon bones always give the meal a special kick. You were saying something about a message? Oh yeah. I was on an errand passing through the abyss when I ran into your little friend the other day. He was awfully upset about what happened. Yeah, poor Nigel. Nigel? Leave him there! Do not, I repeat, do not let him out of the abyss. He was such a pleasant little critter. It's a shame, but if you insist... You're showing me mercy? Something smells foul. 
Oh, wait, that's just you. Considering I have the keys to your little friend's cell, I'd assume you'd be a bit more cautious with your insults. Touché. And there we go, and she hasn't unlocked anything new, so I don't really know how you do that. It, there was something about an achievement of uh, increasing her stock or something like that. I don't quite remember. Let's just pick up some more magic here. Why not? And then we can teleport over here. And then we just have to go... Can we go... We can't go like this way, right? Does this... I guess... Oh, that's going to be a shortcut. Yeah, that makes sense. Okay, so we have to go around this way first, and go through the village. I'm just gonna run past these guys, cause screw them. Oh, hate that thing. God, I hate it so much. I'm so used to just holding the key that you want to travel in, but you can't. And then we have to go around here, and was it out here? No. Oh god, I'm stuck. I have to go all the way around this way. Here we go. So, I guess for this episode I'll try to sort of explore this uh, mountain place thoroughly. Oh god, that's, that's bad, that's bad, that's bad. Okay, we're fine. I guess maybe the boomerang is pretty good, because it's sort of just a DPS increase. Like, you might as well just toss it out. You don't have to think about it like you do with the the flame circle thing that you use. So, that's actually kind of good. Wow. That's actually really good. I'm starting to like this, this boomerang that I almost dismissed completely before. Huh. The more you know. We learn as we play, as always. So... I want to try to see where you can jump off, so I'm pretty sure you could jump off here, but should I? Maybe? Oh! Oh! Huh. So I guess you have to use this? Yeah! Interesting. Interesting. And then you can get in here and get... A key! Huh. And the boomerang, of course, can probably not kill these ones. Not like that. Maybe with the, the lightning? Maybe with the darkness? Nope. We cannot kill these guys yet, as far as I can tell. Oh man, that boomerang. Okay, and we can jump down here. Hi. So, did we talk to this guy? I mean, I kind of loaded, so maybe I haven't talked to this guy again. I don't remember. No, I think I went back here just to make sure I did everything. Yeah, I think I picked something up in here, which is gone now. Hi. Oh, hello. And we're in here. No. Ah, oh, damn. Yeah, it's not... Oh. And those dudes have, like, weaknesses. So, the boomerang can do different amounts of damage depending on the elements. I want... Was it fire? Yeah, apparently I want fire for those guys. Oh, and then you can... Oh, right, you can just sort of sidestep it a little bit, like this. Oh, man, that's kind of hard to do. So, like, if I do this... Oh. Come on. Yeti. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Okay, never mind. I'm not gonna try to play with that. Oh, stop stomping, you idiot. Nope. There we go. Ow. Yeah, and it doesn't take that much magic, so... Yeah, not not that bad. Not as bad as I thought it would be. Just for pure, like, combat purposes. 
Yeah, lightning is very good, but it takes a lot of magic to use. So where am I now? I don't really want to go out here... yet. Some souls... Sure. Oh. Okay, never mind. Oh! I didn't even know you could touch those bombs before they start having an effect. And yeah, you can do this. That's pretty good. That's also pretty good. Yeah. Boomerang. Not too bad. And then this is where I just came from. Yeah. And there wasn't anything else here. I could drop off here. I guess I'll do that. Why not? Ow. Did I go in here? I feel like I did off camera. And I was going to tell you that when I went back here, I just went down here and picked up an item and that was it. But we might jump down there again, but now we're back here. Okay, I see how this works. Yeah, sure, let's jump down here. I'll get some magic anyway. Why not? Just have to kill a bunch of slimes and then there was a uh, box with something. I don't remember. Some item. I was wondering why I wasn't moving. Okay. Can't jump off here. And yeah, I already did jump off here. Yeah. Maybe that is it. Maybe I have checked everything. Now we're back here, yeah. And this is just where the Yeti is. But what about this? Like, where is this? This is something, and I don't know where. So maybe I want to make sure I get that before I... ...quit this, or, uh, corrupt this, rather. Guess I'll just, like, jump off at random places and hope I find it? Hi. Yeah, that is pretty good damage. Pretty good damage. Yeah, we've been here. Huh. Yep. Can't even jump off. Hmm. Well, I guess that's about it. Maybe that part in the, the cave is actually nothing? Maybe you can't get, get there? That would be kind of weird though, like why even make it if you couldn't get here? That does look like an entrance. Huh. As I said, I don't want to corrupt the place if I don't know that I've gotten everything, but... How can I know that I've gotten everything? Wait, I guess I have one idea. Let's try. Because I haven't even found the way to actually progress. 
How do I get to the the screen with the the ice thingy? I don't remember. Yeah, how do you do it? Is it here? I mean, uh, not in here, but... Is it down? Here? Yeah. Oh, yeah! Yeah, we haven't been here. Okay, so let's try this. First, these guys. Yeah, they take quite a lot of shots from fire, but with the boomerang, one shot. Ow. Line it up. Oh, I see. Maybe it's like two shots, so you have to hit them both ways. Some stuff. Don't mind if I do. Oh, no. We, we've been here. Haven't we? Uh... Maybe not. Yeah, just a soul. Ow. I don't think I should jump off, but maybe... That is how you do it? Yeah, here's the corruption thing. Huh. Oh! Oh, this is right here! Oh, I see. So we have done everything. We have definitely done everything in the screen. Nice! Ow. God, these fucking rocks on the ground. Oh. But have we done everything? What is this? I don't know what that is. Wish there was, like, a map for this place. The the caverns. I guess I can jump off here. But first off, let's do this. Yay! Hooray! No cutscene or anything. Yeah, I think I'm gonna jump off here. I, I think I'm not gonna jump off here. What? Okay. So how the hell do you hit the switch? There's stuff in there. Yeah, that doesn't work. Huh. Is this still... above? Oh yeah, it is! No, it isn't. Damn it! We've been here. God, how do you do that? I don't... know. Hi. Please no. Please no. Yeah, that's just back. Just to get some magic back. Oh no. All of these dudes are back as well. I didn't want this. Yeah, I can't really find anything. Well, I guess I'll leave it for now, so I won't corrupt it until I know for sure that I've been in here. So we'll leave it for now.
It's the crystal forest! And a crystal dude. What do these do? They just sort of walk at you. They have a sword, but they don't even try to use it, pretty much. Huh. What weird enemies. And these are basically the bomb-laying dudes, except not. But you get what I mean. I wonder if this is based on, like, ice, so that fire would do more damage, or if it's just crystal. An ice cube! Apparently it's ice. That will never melt. Crack this stone to freeze any enemy near Rack and increase the power of Rack's ice abilities. Oh, we're getting an ice ability, of course. So maybe then... Oh, I see, this is like a spawner. Maybe then with the ice power you can freeze those water tornado things. What would it be? Typhoons? Cy no, not cyclones. What is it? When it's a water? Is it Typhoon? I can't remember. Whirlpool, I guess? Ow. And this guy just won't quit. Hi. I might wait with you. I kind of want to end off the episode pretty soon. As I said, I'm still tweaking the audio and stuff and trying to catch up. So now there's double the issue, double the reason to have short episodes. So sorry, I guess. There's been a lot to do trying to figure out the best way to record and edit and the settings and EQ and whatnot. So that's a thing. I'll stop making excuses one day, but today is not that day. There we go, butterfly dead. Hi. Guess I'll use one of these. Yeah, nice. That works really well. Castle of Her Hi Highness Amun. I see, so now we go here, and then we open up the shortcut. Hooray! Hooray! Yay! I guess that's a good place to end it then. So now we can go back back and forth between the ice crystal path, whatever it's called, and the uh, Amun's castle. So it's a pretty close teleport if we need to go somewhere. So that's cool. But as I said, I will leave it here for now. So I hope you enjoy this episode. I hope the sound is a little bit better, but I don't know if it's going to be until I'm done with this episode. So we'll see. But I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.